Welcome to a horror game called Dispatcher. Now, this is an early access, so there may be some bugs and things like that, and it's only got the single player aspect of it now. I'm going to jump straight into a game, and I'm going to keep my battery light as infinite charge. I did have a quick play of this, and your battery light seems to run out pretty quickly, so for the sake of the video, I'm going to keep it on always, and just keep it too easy, because... I didn't have a good experience last time, so let's see what this one brings. I remember you sons of bitches, I remember everything. As a horrible squee eats into the brain, as Perkins smashed his head on the wall and of the dining room, I remember as young Max rushed to the exposed wires, the smell of his burnt flesh soaked into my subconsciousness. I remember how you left us all in this damn hell. I'll get to you, each sick bastard. You will answer for everything, it is just necessary to get out, I have to. So guys, there's our flashlight, and I'm not really sure, to be quite honest with you, from the first playthrough that I did, of the concept of what we have to do, from, I presume, obviously, that we have to escape, and we get things like pills and things to pick up, and I think we have to go and find things just to go and uh, pick up and open doors, obviously, while something's going to be following us around. You do get a character to be able to pick up, um, make, sorry, pick up, that's because I just picked that up, and you can use it, create them however you want to. Uh, I made mine a drunk, <laughs> not for particular any reason, uh, it's got really good uh, stamina and things like that, I believe it were, energy. But you've got to be particularly quiet around these areas. Just picking these items up, which I'm not sure right now what they do. But if we do see anything, I will be first to be running, trust me. I will be running. <laughs> At the moment, everything seems all clear. There's nothing down this way. Let's go back on ourselves. The other problem with my character is that it's got quite she's got quite loud footsteps. And she's only the female in the game. So I made basically a drunk female, which is always good. I need some noises. Do not like that. Another item. It's got a really eerie aspect to this game. I will say that. I'm like I say I would be like a little bit more direction perhaps as to what I'm actually doing. But it's just for the time in search around what we're doing. And I don't know if we can blow these doors up or something. I don't know how you're supposed to open these doors up. I'm not sure at this moment in time. And that seems to be a trap that's laid there. If I'm able to disarm this trapping somewhere. I'm gonna run through this. Holy shit. Nothing even happened there. I think it's just like, it sounds like radiation, something like that. So not just enemies, it seems like there's traps around the actual map as well, which is a bit of a pain. That's the same text. Uh, Pick all this shit up again. And we'll go straight back down here where we were. I'm not sure how we're supposed to be getting past any of these areas right now. I can hear something. Guys, can you hear that? I don't know if it might be, if you'd be able to hear it or not. I do not know what I want to be going, where I want to be going. Let's see if I can run past this. Yes, I can. Nothing else in that one. And I'm just going to leave that last one for the time being. I don't think there was anything in it last time, though it might be randomly generated. This is pretty spooky of a game. Ooh, we can come in here. Ooh, this is uh, ideal for a bit of private time, isn't it? Bet the janitor had a lot of fun in here before he got his spleen ripped apart. It's a bit gruesome, I know. <laughs> Holy fucking shit! Oh my god. Shut the fucking thing! I do not know what that is, and I do not know where I'm running. Oh my god, my character's out of it, elf. Oh god. 
do not know what the fuck that was. And I hope I've just managed to, like, outrun it. Quick, let myself in this janitor area, wherever it was. This, there we go. You will never see me. Turn my flashlight off. I apologise if it goes dark, but don't want this thing fa freaking catching me. Let the music still go in. I don't know if to... If it's safe or not. God, that was really fucking jump scary. It really was. I don't know what the fuck that was. Seems it's quieting down a bit. I do not have a clue what the hell that was. Still around these areas though. Still around these areas. Sounds like he's nomming on something. Oh god, this game is pretty eerie. See anything in this room to be taken? There's another air vent. Which way to go? There's a question. We'll take the air vent. Seems to be the most noisiest route, but we'll take it. As long as nothing uh, comes chasing me in this bloody air vent. That seems to be something like a key. Some kind of like that. That looks like to me. Ooh. I can hear some creepers around here. Oh, folk. Guys, guys. Seems to be some sort of like server room or something. Oh, there we go. We could get in here. I think I use that key card to get in here. Oh, look what's down here. Seems to be some kind of. I'm not sure what that is, to be quite honest with you. Couple of things on the opposite side of there. It looks like it needs to be opened up. Oh, I can hear it again. Sounds like its belly's rumbling as well. Trust me, sir, I do not taste good. Let's stay quiet. Let's stay vigilant. Yes, I can see jack shit right now. I don't know if we're able to place these or something behind us as like traps. Ah, they're, sh they're for your battery. They're uh, battery lights, but we've got infinite charge anyway, so it doesn't make a difference. Seems to be doing well at the moment for avoiding. I'm starting to get the concepts a little bit more as to what we're doing and what each one of these items does. Doesn't mean it's any <laughs> any less scary to be playing it. I'm starting to grasp a concept of what it, it is. So the pills are basically going to be your health. The second one is to recharge your light and the other two by the looks of things. I don't know if I've already been down here. I believe I have. I'm gonna go back this way anyway. Basically, the opposite way to the noises. 
And I haven't been in here. So realistically, I don't need to be picking these up. I could pick the health up. I'll pick them up anyway. If I pick them up, I know that I've been here. And let's tiptoe everywhere. Watch out for these little explosives. Let's take this as well. Ooh. Hello? You look well done. Yeah, let's just not hang around there. Oh, there's a trap here. Is there any way that we can actually disarm this? I don't believe that we can disarm that. I might be wrong, but I'm not seeing any way to actually do it. I don't think there's anything else down here either. Guess I can take the axe out of his head. Be ideal. I didn't play this game on anything but freaking easy. Let's uh, head down here. Try this way out. I believe that might be the way out, but... Try and find the other way around. Oh, it seems bright in here. A lot of items about. I don't seem to be finding any keys or anything. Hello, Mr. Monster. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance. It's not real. Please just leave me alone. I don't taste good, I swear. I don't know if I've been here or not, but we'll go in this air vent. Oh, don't know if that's the opposite side to where I've just been. Yes, it is. So we know the opposite side of that is now. There's nothing down here to really be explored. We're doing well to not bump into anything else. Looks like it's some sort of door that needs to be opened. And we've been down here already. <laughs> Trying to not run too much. I think they are quite noise vigilant. Holy oh, if, if only I had my dead silence with me. Probably not a bright idea because this sounds like where the noise is coming from. I'm gonna go this way. Because we need to find the exit. It seems like we need something to place on there to be able to open this door. Don't know what though. Ooh! Them legs. I know that's what you're all staring at, guys. But seriously, I'm just gonna walk around like this. Oh, look at this health. I just have to bend down. Oh, look at the jiggle physics on that baby. Anyway, enough distraction. Let's get on with this. Ooh. Surely I can uh, come to so some sort of arrangement with the uh, monster with them. Them legs. Let's run down this corridor. Oh! Be careful. I'm start trying to run a little bit more. I need to get through this as quickly as possible. 
been this. Oh, that's where the cube is. That. Can I take it? Ah, there we go. Probably I remember which way it was now. I think it was this way. Ooh, careful. Careful. There we go. Chuck it on there properly. And then boobs of yours. Oh, there we go. I said it. There we go guys, I actually managed to, uh, managed to actually complete this game. The estimated probability of finding your capture was 0.00404%. I don't know how accurate that actually was, but we actually got out of there guys alive, which was pretty good. And I'm surprised how good the jiggle, jiggle physics, I mean the monsters actually look on this game, obviously. And hopefully there will be, it says some multiplayer coming to this soon, so looks like a pretty good game guys, but thank you for watching this video, I hope you had the same experience as me, and if you are watching this late at night, I hope you can sleep tight, and uh, don't let the bed bugs bite, and I'm sure I've left something to your imagination with this video, so thank you for watching, and share this video, make sure you are subscribing for more of this kind of content, and as always, thank you.